our solution to my initial methane complaint. And I guess, but anyway, and this is something else that I. So you're supposed to live yeah. like that. Unbelievable. We, like I said, we were getting those biweekly water tests. And in the end of February, they didn't show up. When the second week came along and they didn't show up, I couldn't get anybody from what, Chesapeake while well, I actually talked to Chesapeake and they suggested the test was still happening. So I called the water company and they said they were informed by Chesapeake that even though this is a DEP directive, that they can drop the test down to a quarterly test. So now I'm only being tested quarterly. I'm going to walk up and take a picture. Go right ahead. You know how I feel. And what's that's a, pad, a well pad over there going in well right by. Over there, yeah. Is that your land, Sherry? Yes. Are they your cows? Yes. Are you concerned with that? Um, they are get a water source from a spring right. that is so far tested normally, but I can't have anything in the barn because of my contamination. Not in the good. barn. Right. There's nothing in the barn. Wait a minute. Because of your contamination of the water? The water. Do you just hear that? No. She can't have any. I'm sorry. Say that again. Um, basically, those, those are my beef herd. Uh -huh. They are. They get their water source from a spring. I don't have any animals in the barn anymore because of the contamination of the water. The animals don't like to drink it. And it's off of a well. Well, it's a happen since... You know, Chesapeake. No, but it's well water in the barn. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Chesapeake and DEP are concerned with the methane level, but when I took that first water source to the vet, he said that the chemicals in there could cause internal organ damage to the animals because of the quantity. Oh my God. And so I started giving away my animals. What kind of What kind of animals did you have? I had a dairy herd. You had a dairy. dairy so herd. you got rid of the whole dairy herd because of this. You well, were concerned with the health. Um. We sold off, we'll put this all in perspective. We sold off the main herd prior to them drilling because we knew they were going to destroy the pasture. Right. But we had replacement heifers, young stock, and we were selling them off, you know, as the market allowed. When our water became contaminated, I had four pigs, a small dairy replacement herd, you know, the heifers, and my daughter-in-law's horses. And like I said, after a trip to the vet, and I said, well, I'm not going to eat the beef I've been raising for two and a half years because he might have something wrong with him. Right. And I didn't dare sell him, so he went to Cargill as um, condemned meat. Right. And that's the issues that have kept now, question. developing. Department of Ag or DEP, any concern with any of that with the animals? No. About food safety? I mean, did you discuss anything with them? Yes. DEP's only concern is that I had an explosive level of methane. And what did they say about the animals with, they, with the safety of the food their or stance, testing? Their stance to this day is if I have, give a chance for the water to aerate, it is perfectly safe to use. When I express my concerns to them, like I said, we were just determined contaminated in June. Come winter, when I discovered the water wasn't freezing, and again, voiced my concerns to them, their stance is, given a chance to aerate, the water is perfectly safe to use. So there was no, no question about testing anything for food safety, no, no um, communication with Department of Ag, this is happening, um, you should not sell these, eat these, nothing. Nothing. Their stance is... Get it, let it air rate is perfectly safe to use. See, now this is my whole problem with this because here we have you, dairy farmer, no longer doing dairy because the health of the animal is your concern. Mm -hmm. State agencies doing if, if nothing was, to check. Because at that point, see. I wasn't they shipping milk, right. or I could have brought in the Department of Ag right. because I'm not shipping milk. It wasn't an issue for them. Right. But eat, what about the beef cattle? You would think that would have been, right? That's my argument. I right. said this is part of the food chain. Right. This animal goes to McDonald's, somebody gets sick, right. somebody sues McDonald's, you're going to pay attention. Right. I'm out here hollering, and you're not listening. The metal's inferior. Talk to the welders. A 